I'm cleaning my attic now at the moment and I found this beautiful old um, touch contact from Philips from the 1970s. Beautifully first experiment, a first try to make a uh, switch that could be um, used by touching it, by touching these points in the circuit. You can see here that there are two electrodes isolated from each other and when you touch the two electrodes with one finger the resistance of your finger um, makes a kind of contact and your uh, radio or whatever switches on or off. I think it was used for a radio because I can read here FM and manual. So I think three channels from this radio um, could be switched on by these touch contacts. It's a beautiful piece of equipment and I think it's um, the right place for such a device is in the museum. You see how it, how it was made. There are four neon tubes and there are here switch transistors. These ones, I think these, these, these transistors here switch the high voltage. Looking at their code numbers, they are suitable to switch this neon tube. I think approximately 80 volts or 100 volts or so. So when you touch the front, one of the tubes switched on, etc. Beautiful old piece of equipment and I'm sure it was made by Philips in the Netherlands. When I look at the components. Typical Philips components. So let's pan over this beautiful old piece of equipment. Nowadays it's very normal that when you touch a screen um, things switch. We have touch screen uh, telephones, uh, televisions, etc., etc. But in those days, in the 1970s, this was very um, peculiar. Here is another unit connected to that touch switch. Beautiful old piece of Philips equipment used in radio.